never dread packing my suitcase because it always means that I'm about to go on some great travel adventure. My name is Shay from Mission 2 Organize and we're here today to give you some great tips on how you can pack your suitcase for your next adventure. First you'll want to decide which size suitcase you need. Now you can do this based on your destination. A warm weather destination you'll need smaller clothes, thus a smaller suitcase. And for colder climates, you'll want bulkier clothes, therefore a larger suitcase. Now, you can also determine your suitcase size based on the duration of your trip. Longer trip, bigger suitcase. Shorter trip, shorter suitcase. Before you start packing your suitcase, make sure you have a comprehensive list. We actually have a very helpful checklist on our website, which you can download for free. Now, when you fold your shirts, you'll want to start by folding them in half, and then rather than folding them again, you can just roll them straight down. Be sure that you don't have any creases in the fabric, and make sure it's nice and tight. This way, you can fit many more clothes in your suitcase. You don't want to do that, however, with your pants, so you'll just fold them in half and give them a nice three-fold. Typically, this particular fold fits really nicely in the bottom of your suitcase. So for all of your smaller items, you'll want to contain those inside of mesh, canvas, and silk bags like we have here. We actually have one that is specifically for undergarments. We have one full of socks. And we have one with your belts. Now these are nice because they can stuff in anywhere inside of your suitcase that you need to fill space so that you can make this really tight. You'll also want to have bags for your shoes for sure so that you don't soil anything inside of your suitcase. Many of the cosmetics and toiletries that you'll pack inside of your suitcase are gels and liquids and you don't want them spilling out so you want to contain them. You can do that with a bag, a travel bag, like we have here, which is specifically meant for that purpose. Or, if you don't have one, that's okay. You can use a gallon-sized zippered plastic baggie, and that will keep all of the contents of your suitcase nice and safe. Also, for your jewelry, you can have separate pouches, one for necklaces, bracelets, and earrings. And these pouches actually work really nice for your cosmetics as well. If you're bringing an extra purse by chance on your trip, you can tuck that right inside. This will fill up some of the extra space inside of your suitcase because you'll want to make it nice and tight so that it doesn't shift along your journey. Voila! We wish you safe travels and a fun journey on your next travel adventure. Bon voyage!